Nemo Radio is on the air. A, B, C. A, always B, B, C. Closing. Always be closing. Always be closing. Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Put that coffee down. Coffee's for closers only. Come after me! I'm a man! I'm 40! <laughs> we are. I'm laughing at myself. Laugh with me. Welcome, everybody. It's John Nemo. We are going live. Tiger King has nothing on me today. Joe Exotic, eat your heart out. All right. <laughs> I have so much fun in store for you. So without further ado, I want to dive in today to kind of my favorite tips around the fast, easy, and non-sleazy way to generate leads and get a ton of business using LinkedIn. That sounds good to everyone. Then let's proceed, right? All right, good, good, good. So first things first, if you don't know me, I, I want to start uh, by obviously sharing <laughs> sharing a little bit about me. Fun fact, I've been social distancing since 2012. Here I am playing Star Wars at home with one of our three wild boys, Alex, um, wearing a popcorn bucket on my head. Um, so I like to have a lot of fun and inject that into my work, into my trainings. Fun fact, I was once featured on a cookie. Uh, spoiler alert, I do taste delicious, by the way. <laughs> this was one of my LinkedIn richest students as a thank you. Um, whipped Bake Shop, Brennan Lucas. Uh, out, I think he's in Philadelphia. Made me a cookie, frozen and shipped it. So there you go. Anything is possible. Anything is possible when you run your business on the internet. Okay. So again, I do have bona fide credentials. Don't worry. It's not just a stand-up comedy act if you don't know me at all. Uh, I am an author of LinkedIn Riches trainer, done a bunch of cool stuff, been featured in a bunch of exciting places, written seven, I think eight books now, I can't remember, but a lot of uh, value that I'm going to bring you today with kind of a deep dive here on LinkedIn. So without further ado, I want to dive into this. I want to really make sure that we pack in as much training as we can. So let's go and start here because this is, hey, thanks, Zach. I'm glad you like that book. All right. So, um, this is the number one question people always have around selling on LinkedIn. And, and who can name this movie? In the chat, type in the name of this movie. This will be the first of many 1980s references. I want to make sure I have the right audience here. So name the movie. You can also name the actor. Put it in the chat right now. I'm waiting with bated breath here to see if you know what movie this is and what actor this is. So come on, come on, come on. Zach's got the book on his desk right now. I love it. All right. So Fletch, no, Jennifer, incorrect. That, you know, a lot of people guess Fletch. Anthony, yeah, you're all going with Fletch. Rich is the winner. It's Vacation. Chevy Chase from the movie Vacation, Gracie knows. Um, this is where he's going to the used car parking lot. And he's like, I'm not your ordinary everyday fool, okay? And so many people have that kind of visceral negative reaction to sales. And, oh, gosh, if you're going to sell on LinkedIn, you have to be spammy, all that. So I want to really help you understand that's not the case. Also, more importantly... Would a guy who dresses this well and wears Zubas live on the internet, would I steer you wrong? <laughs> like, no, the point of this is, listen, if a guy that dresses like this can have a successful business and can make sales on LinkedIn, what's stopping you? Honestly, what is stopping you from being successful? That's what's so fun about this approach. That's why you should be inspired today as you go through this. And most importantly, Viva Cajas. Oh, there it is. I love it. How you doing, Vivica? You have a great story. Vivica uh, recently landed a five-figure client using what I'm going to be teaching today. So, and I have other screenshots and examples. Vivica, I don't have you in the presentation yet, but she's a rock star. Vivica has, uh, we'll talk more later, but she's already killing it on LinkedIn. So yeah, you're hanging in there. <laughs> Love it. All right. So here's how I know this works and why I know this works. So back very, very quickly, my GQ rating. You guys are funny today. I love it. Back in 2012, this is the quick version of my story. Like a lot of people, I was working a corporate job I wasn't passionate about. And, you know, I didn't have coronavirus or anything like that back in 2012. But I really wanted to come home and work from home. And the big motivation was these three little knuckleheads you see in this photo. And I wanted to find a way to quit my job, come home, open my own marketing agency, build a book of business and live kind of happily ever after professionally. So without a lot of foresight, without a lot of planning, because that's not how I roll, I, I quit my day job. I quit a safe 
six figure corporate day job. I had one client. I had enough money for 30 days and I left. I walked out the door November 4th, 2012. I still remember the exact day. And I'll never forget that mix of you, you know, euphoria and fear as I walked down the steps of that office. And that's the last time I ever had a day job. It was on me to create this business. It was on me to find a way to sell and create leads. And I had to do it online because I didn't have a budget. I couldn't travel. Uh, you know, nobody knew who I was. So thankfully I had a plan. And in the first 90 days, being on my own in 2012, all using LinkedIn, all from my home office, I was able to generate over six figures in new business by myself in my quote unquote office. Here's a look at my office, right? There's Rosie the dog. <laughs> um, that was it. I had a laptop. I didn't even have a microphone at the time. And I was able to generate six figures in new business using LinkedIn, how I'm going to show you today. But more importantly, another pause, where are my dog people at? Right now in the comments, I need to know I have the right crowd on this webinar. Tell me the name of your dog. So I'm going to type this in the, uh, in the comments, a uh, name of dog and breed, name of your dog and type of dog. Super important. Rosie's Wheaton Terrier. Uh, we have so much fun together. Uh, Bruce, this is a Blue Yeti microphone, just so you know. Blue Yeti. Okay, now, Alfie the Poodle. All right, we got Wolfie. Oh, what kind of dog is Wolfie, Vivica? We got Riley the Shih Tzu. We got a Goldie named Gunner. Goldies are the best. They're so friendly. Mercedes the Yorkie. All right. Man, these are coming in fast. Okay, we got Lainey, a Plot Hound and a Coon Hound. Misty, a Yellow Lab. Aw. Allie sounds like a nice dog. That's a nice name. Aw, you guys have some great biscuit. What a great dog name, Bob Kinney. Four dogs, Nancy? Oh my gosh. No cats, Gary. No cats. No cats allowed. Now, <laughs> uh, by the way, I'm so glad you guys are here and, and understanding dogs are the best. Cats are far secondary. Let's just let's just get this clear. And again, what I'm sharing with you today. This is not rocket science. If a guy who wears a popcorn bucket on his head and dresses in Zubas and shares pictures of his dogs online can do this, there's no reason you can't immediately implement what you're going to learn today. Okay, so here's some examples of real life students of mine using this approach. In 24 hours, Paramita, an accountant, got a $24,000 recurring client. Okay, in 24 hours of rewriting her profile, and I'll talk more about that in a little bit. Suzanne Feinberg, you might be on today, Suzanne, but I love this. She posted this uh, just here in March. She said, oh, my God, everyone should have this problem. She was, you know, we were getting responses from all 90 new connections we added, all want pricing and availability. We're going crazy. She hadn't even finished Section 1 of my training and had 90 leads saying, I want pricing and availability. Like, so what I'm telling you is these are people, real people from real walks of life with real businesses implementing what you're going to learn today. And the key is implementing and getting incredible results. So Mark McGraw, sales trainer, got a $30,000 client. Yeah, Suzanne is on. Great. You've had huge sales off of LinkedIn. So this is Suzanne in the comments right now. She's in section three. You're already crushing. So I love the fact that you're here on today learning because yeah, you're living proof of how well this works. Mark Sandler, $30,000 client. And I'm showing some of these bigger ticket items so that for those of you that are like, well, you can't sell high ticket programs, high ticket courses. No, you can like five figure kind of sales, right? This is Bill Prater, a business coach, $7,500 monthly retainer. This is a $90,000 deal he did from LinkedIn, a backlog of new prospects. Okay. There's lots and lots of people. I have tons of stories like this. Um, yeah, you are the conduit. Brad's profile. I love it, Suzanne. You guys are killing it. Okay, so how does it all work, right? What's the secret sauce? What's the magic formula? Let's get into this. It, it's really fast. It's really easy. And best of all, it's not sleazy. That's the key thing with this approach on LinkedIn and why it works so well. So let's start, first of all, with the easy way to generate leads on LinkedIn. We need to really build there. And we have to start by talking about your profile. Again, I need to know that I have the right crowd. Name this movie in the comments right now. We're live. Tell me the movie. This is one of the great 80s movies. I think it came out in 1981. So let's see. Let's test. Uh, I don't know. There might be a little bit of a lag. Name the movie. Uh, let's see. I want to know that I have my people here. Glory. Come on, come on, bring it on. I'm going to have a drink while I'm waiting. Exorcist. Oh my gosh, Philip. No, 
That would be a good one, though. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Yes. Okay, good. You nailed it. You guys are all over this. Yes, yes, yes. This is the penultimate scene where the Nazis' faces are melting off when they open the Ark of the Covenant. And unfortunately, a lot of prospects have this reaction when they're looking at your LinkedIn profile, right? <laughs> so, so we have to talk about that. Okay, so here's, here's an unofficial statistic I just made up. <laughs> okay, 99% of LinkedIn profiles are set up the wrong way. Honestly, and this is just from having done this for the past decade, I've personally reviewed probably 16 to 17,000 LinkedIn profiles for clients and students and things like that. Almost 99% of them in the beginning are set up the wrong way. What I mean by this is most LinkedIn profiles are set up to be what? All about you. They're written like a resume. They're written like a virtual, you know, kind of here's all my story. You talk about yourself in the third person. Here's the problem with that. Here's the problem with going back one slide, a profile that's all about you. There's a big problem. Let me get to it. Here it is. Nobody cares, right? Nobody cares about you. I'm so sorry to break this news to you. But when it comes to sales and marketing, I'm going to shoot you straight. Um, nobody cares. And I, I built my entire business off this one quote. So if you get nothing else out of this training other than the fact that you should wear Zubas and publish pictures of your dog everywhere, here it is. Write this down. Your customers only care about themselves morning, noon, and after supper. Okay, Dale Carnegie, How to Win Friends and Influence People. I literally built my entire business, my entire marketing, customer service, the way I treat employees, everything built off this quote. People only care about themselves. So when we apply that to LinkedIn, now it gets interesting. Now it gets good, okay? Here it is. Instead of having that bullhorn approach on the left where it's all about you and it's written like a resume and it's written in the third person about you and your accolades, I want you instead to channel Fix It Felix. Now, I don't know how many of you remember this. So instead of, again, having this profile that's written like a resume, bullhorn, et cetera, et cetera, we're going to instead be like Fix It Felix. So let's ditch the bullhorn and let's get into Fix It Felix. Now, this is my favorite part of all my trainings. I have a burning question I want to know the answer to. Here it is. Who remembers the 80s? Glory! This is my time. Who can, who can hit, pull out photos like this? Rocking the tube socks, rocking the short shorts. If you're a millennial, it's okay. If you weren't alive in the 80s, just watch the movies or the Netflix series Stranger Things. This is really what it was like. This truly is what it was like. Um, and I love the analogy of Fix It Felix. Right, because if you haven't seen the movie Fix It Felix, it's all about a kind of a 1980s type video arcade, much like this one. And it's about all the characters that live inside the video games. And yes, okay, yes, Gary's got tube socks. Nancy's saying, ugh, what does that mean, Nancy? Come on, Nancy. I want proof of you in tube socks and your four dogs, uh, you know, uh, as well. Okay, Galaga Juan, of course it's Galaga. Name your favorite game right now. Um, in the comments we've got asteroids and galaga from leonard there's turbo in there the correct answer by the way if you're not sure what to type into the chat is miss pac-man Ooh, tetris is a winner brenda that is really fun pinball is really fun vicky i'm gonna give you a pass and say pinball does count millipede wow you're going deep joust oh my god these are great pac-man i like miss pac-man better rich i ain't gonna lie gary says time pilot i don't know that one i have to look up my 80s references. Okay, Maria, Pac-Man. Yeah, these are good. These are good. All right, solid, solid, solid. Tetris, Scrabble, free cell game. Okay, all right, okay, we're going the wrong way. So in this movie, and here's the analogy I want you to really understand about your LinkedIn profile. Oh, Kong is making an appearance. Donkey Kong and Qbert. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. In Wreck-It Ralph, in the video game land, in this movie, the most popular person who there lives there is Fixed Felix. He, and the reason he's so popular, you can see it here, he has this golden hammer. He walks around with this golden hammer and fixes everyone's problems. He goes around solving everyone's problems. And so everyone loves this character because all he does all day, every day is solve his problems. And I can't think of a better way to drive this point home to really make sure you understand than you know, to cite one of the great lyrical poets of our generation. <laughs> I can't do it with a straight face. Who remembers Vanilla Ice? All of you do. 
All of you know the lyrics. So here's the key thing. If you got a problem, yo, I'll solve it. Now check out the moves when my DJ revolves it. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, here's the deal. Vanilla Ice said it so well. And Fix It Felix illustrates it. Your LinkedIn profile needs to be all about the problems that you solve for your ideal clients and customers. Yes, Brenda, I just put Vanilla Ice up there. I'm a man that wears Zubas on the internet, Brenda. Do you really think I'm worried about Vanilla Ice? Woo! All right. So yes. All right. The key of this, and we're having fun, but you'll remember this because you're going to be like, I can't believe I just was on a live train with Vanilla Ice. You'll remember the hook here, which is to make your profile client facing, to make it about the problems that you solve. This is the secret sauce with having this first foundational piece in place. It's the problems that you solve for your ideal clients and the audiences that you serve. So let's show you some real-time examples of how this looks. Oh, but first, 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 first. Speaking of audiences, I want everyone to lean in closer to their computer, to their monitor, to their iPad. If you have earbuds in, push them in further. I have a secret. I have a secret for you. So everyone listen. Okay, I'm going to whisper it. I'm going to whisper it in the microphone. I want to make sure everyone's ready. The riches are in the niches. The riches are in the niches. This is so important with LinkedIn. The riches are in the niches. The big thing you have to understand with LinkedIn profiles is you cannot try to be everything to everyone. If you try to be everything to everyone, you'll be nothing to nobody. Remember, LinkedIn is this enormous platform. There's 700 million members, 200 different countries and territories. There's two new members joining every single second. You cannot possibly appeal to all 700 million. That's why what I found and what you'll see here is that the riches are in these niche audiences, right? <laughs> all right, here we go. So again, to really drive this point home with another great 80s reference, name this movie. Can everyone name this movie? Um, all right, name this 80s movie. All right, let's see it. Let's. I'm going deep on 80s trivia. I'm impressed so far. I'm impressed. Keith Richards Espresso Special. <laughs> Vivica, I am hopped up. I am high on life and high on caffeine. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay, here's the deal. It's not gone with the wind. It's Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Vivica, your answer was totally bogus. <laughs> All right, Bill and Ted, whoa. This is an important thing, and I want to drive this point home. If you're trying to be everything to everyone on LinkedIn, you will be nothing to no one. You will be nothing to no one. You have to niche down, okay? I'm going to show you these examples. But in my own backstory, back in 2012, quitting my day job with one client, enough money for 30 days, how did I get six figures in revenue in 90 days? What I was able to do was niche myself into the debt collection space. The reason was I had exactly one client. He happened to be a debt collector. I had worked a day job in the past for a trade association that served debt collectors. So for me, what I decided to do, because I only had one client and he was a debt collector and the riches are in the niches, my LinkedIn approach was debt collection marketing guy. And that's the one little niche I played in this tiny little niche and I immediately got six figures in revenue. I'm going to show you how this works. So here it is. The first step, this is a very practical step, something you can do right away, get a quick win. I love it, Brenda. Dude, awesome. Okay. Your LinkedIn headline should have two things. And your LinkedIn headline is what's right under your photo, you know, on LinkedIn. And I can show you that in a screen share a little bit later, but it's the service you provide and then a niche audience that you serve. A service you provide and a niche audience you serve. So let me show you what this looks like. So on my LinkedIn profile, here's the headline. The service I provide highlighted in red is LinkedIn lead generation. Now the niche audience I'm going after with LinkedIn is business coaches, consultants, and small business owners. Now I can do this for anyone, right? I can do, I do LinkedIn lead generation for people in dozens and dozens of different industries, different countries, all types of business, basically anyone who does B2B, I can help with LinkedIn lead generation. What I have found, again, the riches are in the niches. So what I'm doing is going to a targeted niche audience of coaches, consultants, and business owners, and here's the service. So what does it look like in another example? Paramita, right? She got that quick win uh, in 24 hours, a $24,000 client. Look at how we niched her LinkedIn headline. 
She's an accountant, so she can do this for anyone. She can do bookkeeping and accounting for anyone. But what we did when I rewrote Paramita's profile with her was we said, let's talk about your service and let's make it specific to construction you know, industry members. So in red is the services she provides, construction, accounting, and bookkeeping, and then virtual CFO and controller services, right? For construction businesses and home builders. See, that's the whole idea with this. And another example, you got Pete. He's in Florida. He's another client of ours. Uh, and Melody, thank you. Sorry, comment, pause here. They, yeah, I'm going to be doing a presentation with David Sattman Garland. It's going to be amazing. You're going to have a ton of fun. Okay, Juan, do you ever work with content? Of course I work with content writers, Juan. Yes, I work with everyone. Okay, so <laughs> Pete, but, but this example, headline, your LinkedIn headline is the service you provide plus a target audience. The service he provides, insurance, agency, franchising, and training for in blue there, underlined in blue, a specific target audience, licensed Florida insurance agents who want to grow a successful agency. See how targeted that is. And think about your own LinkedIn headline right now. Most LinkedIn profile headlines will say something like CEO, company name, or you know, job title, blah, blah, blah. Like It doesn't tell anyone what is in it for them. And that's why these headlines work so much better than company name, title, whatever it is, or the aspirational, you know, ninja, lead generation guru, whatever. So think, I'll give you one more example. Good buddy of mine, Paul Klein. I'm going to mention him more later. But again, what's the service he provides? Business scaling and pricing strategy for, and then the audience is business coaches and consultants. Same idea. And that's really a key thing. The goal here is within two seconds, you want people understanding what's in it for them. What do you do? Who do you help? Why would I want to connect with you? Because remember, when you get invites from people on LinkedIn, when you get messages, all you're seeing is their headline, their photo, and that's it. So if I can't decide within two seconds whether or not I care, I'm not going to connect with you. I'm not going to pay attention. But think of it this way. If I'm a construction company and I own a construction business and I see Paramita's invite, she's all about me. See how this works? She's all about providing a specific service for people like me. Same idea with Pete. If I'm in Florida and I run an insurance agency or I'm a licensed insurance agent, what's in it for me if I connect with this guy? What can he help me do? See how clear that is? If I'm a coach or consultant and Paul Klein reaches out, what's in it for me? Okay, you work with coaches and consultants. What's the service? Oh, you can help me with my pricing. See how clear that is. Within two seconds, you know what these people do, and that's the key. So what about the rest of your profile? Because right, we've only scratched the surface. We've only fixed your headline so far. So let's get into this. The first sentence of your LinkedIn profile, so, so important. Okay, I want to take you through this. This is the first sentence you want to use right in that about section at the top. What I do, Colin, I help, insert the name of your target audience, achieve their goal, right, a goal that they want by providing your product or service. Again, see how clear that is. What I do, I help this target audience get a benefit they want by providing your product or service. You don't start with talking about yourself, accolades and awards, being aspirational. You just cut right to the chase. I help this type of person get this outcome by providing this product or service. That is so critical. Here's an example when I was able to really blow up my business back in 2012, again, just niching down to debt collectors. So my first sentence on my LinkedIn profile, you can see the headline I used back in 2011 through 2015 was debt collection industry, marketing consultant, debt collection marketing, right? Like very clear headline, like debt collection people are who I help and I do marketing. First line, what we do, right? We help your debt collection agency. There's my audience. Here's the benefits they get. Increased revenue, win new clients, enhance and protect their brand online. How? By providing this service, industry-specific marketing and PR. That's that template in action. What I do, I help this audience get these benefits by providing this service. So other examples, Paramita, the accountant I was talking about earlier, what I do, colon, right there at the top of her section, I help this type of audience, residential and commercial construction businesses and home builders, get these benefits they want, which is increased profits, streamline financial processes, improve cash flow. Those are things they want. How? By providing these services that she has. Industry-specific accounting, bookkeeping, et cetera. So see how clear this is. Within two seconds, you're going to capture attention. And this is a great example of this principle. Paramita, basically, we wrote 
we rewrote her profile and within 24 hours, I got a message from her and here it is landed my first client after you optimized my profile, sending the engagement letter for signing. Thanks. And then she screenshotted the conversation. This is how fast it works. This is how quick you can get a win on LinkedIn when you're that hyper niched and hyper focused. She got a $24,000 client within 24 hours. And by the way, the client found her, found her on LinkedIn, read through her profile, realized, oh, I'm a construction company. I need help with accounting, bookkeeping, and virtual CFO services. It looks like Paramita is all about me. And as I'll show you later on throughout her profile, it just talks more and more about that. They basically messaged her, and this is the screenshot, and said, hey, we'd like to talk to you about your services. How does it look? How does it work? Right? It's that fast. So the other key thing when you're doing a profile rewrite is to really understand using what I call mini headlines. And I have templates for this and I have lots of different places I can share this with you, but things like what I do, how I do it, see how those pop and stand out because people are scrolling up and down on your LinkedIn profile. You want to make sure they can quickly see and pick out things that matter to them. What others say, oh, what do they say about you? Why does this work, right? And so again, you go through and you use these mini headlines. This is an example from Paramita's profile, what I do, why it matters, services I provide, and she's using some great emojis there. I'm a big fan of using kind of industry specific emojis. So services I provide, instead of dashes or bullet points, she's got little construction cranes, just to visually remind her target audience of construction people yeah, I'm all about you. I'm all about working in your world. This is the powerful stuff. What others say using a little emoji of people uh, speaking. Now, Philip says what I do is not specific. Well, I would challenge that. I don't know you yet, Philip, but you you provide like I could do a real time example. Philip, type in the comments what the services that you provide. And then what I always tell people is, look, I get it. If you have a bunch of different services, I get it. If you have a bunch of different audiences, here's what you need to know. Um, you can use LinkedIn just to target one or two audiences. You can still use your website, Facebook, and other channels, email to target you know, anyone and everyone. But with LinkedIn, what really works is niching to one audience. So two slides before this one. Okay. This one, what I do, how I do it, why it works. Okay. So I'm not sure if you mean this, um, but basically you want to make sure that like, so for someone like you, Philip, organizational, okay, so developing cooperation. So basically, Philip, the way we niche you is I help type of business. And if you don't know who to pick for your niche, reverse engineer your most successful clients. Like for you, Philip, where have you had the biggest win, the biggest success, the biggest transformation? Which client can you point to as a shining case study, a shining testimonial? Take that type of business bottle that up and use that as your niche for LinkedIn. So for random example, um, if you, Philip, went out and crushed it for a dental office, make your LinkedIn profile be organizational transformation for dental clinics and dental offices, right? What others say, Philip transformed our world, said Dennis Joe, you know? And then Philip, you go out and target other dentists and offer them the same service, okay? So Dennis is in your sole prop. Uh, do you express as what I do? Yeah, I would. I mean, I would just say if you're a consultant or a solo business owner, just say what I do, I help. I mean, it's, you know, you don't have to make it sound phony. You can just be clear. And, and again, this slide says clarity carries the day. And that's really true. Big thing with LinkedIn profiles, and I want to keep moving is avoid the hype and hyperbole. Don't call yourself the Bruce Lee of branding. Don't talk about how you can save me $10 million in 10 seconds. Right, right, right. That's just like, wow. Ah. Uh, Rich, I will, I don't, I, I'll be, I'm trying to get a replay, Rich. Yes, to your question. I'm hoping it works. I, you know, tech God's willing. So yes, I'll try to have a replay for you. Um, so anyway, with your LinkedIn profile, no ninjas, no gurus, no Jedis. I audited my connections once. I was connected to something like 398 ninjas, 748 gurus. I was even connected to a couple lead generation Jedis. Like people see right through that. People want simple and clear, and they don't want hype and hyperbole and shenanigans. So 
to really summarize this first part with your profile, make sure it's client facing. It's not a resume. You talk about the problems that you solve. The riches are in the niches and you use these mini headlines. You really dive into that. Okay. Explaining it clearly so they can scan and immediately see what's in it for them when they connect with you. So now let's move into the next section. I want to talk about the fast way to generate leads on LinkedIn. All right, another trivia question <laughs> I shouldn't even need to ask, and the sequel to this movie is coming out. But in the comments, I want to make sure you're still with me. Type in the name of this movie. Bonus points if you can, on the right-hand side is Goose, if you can name the TV series that Goose went on to become famous in. Top Gun all the way. Highway to the Danger Zone, am I right? You can't tell me Kenny Loggins wasn't the soundtrack of the 80s with um, all those movies. Oh, my God. Top Gun all the way. Top Gun 2 is coming. What? Yeah, ER. Goose went on to star in ER. Deborah, you win. You're all over it, my people. Glory. Here's what's exciting about this. Yes, Elizabeth says Top Gun. How about that volleyball scene? Every woman I know faints when the Top Gun volleyball scene comes out and they're all oiled up. Oh, my God. Anyway. <laughs> LinkedIn is one of the world's largest search engines. When you understand how LinkedIn works, they have gone big brother on every single member. They have indexed and sorted and saved every piece of data, every keystroke you've ever entered and created this enormous search engine. So what LinkedIn essentially is, is Google for leads. It's Google for B2B leads. You can use LinkedIn search to find people. You can sort the filters by jobs, companies, groups, schools, content. All of it's there. LinkedIn is Google search for B2B prospects. This is why I spend all my time on LinkedIn. This is why I have built my entire book of business since 2012 on LinkedIn. There is no better place to be, okay? There just isn't. So imagine this, this is the analogy I use. If you walked in, I know we can't do live events right now, but what if you could, what if you could go to a conference again? What if you walked into a live event and all the healthcare CEOs that ran hospitals were in one area wearing red t-shirts that said healthcare CEO? What if on the conference floor, every small business owner who lived in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania and went to Penn State was wearing a blue shirt that told you all that information? What if all the people in yellow were history professors from Harvard? What, you know, like if you sorted everyone into color coded groups, well, that's what LinkedIn does. That's what LinkedIn search lets you do is sort and save people into groups. And this gets really, really powerful because once you understand how to tap into LinkedIn search, you can create this ready-made list of your exact decision makers. You can use Boolean search and other terms in LinkedIn and search filters. So for example, if I wanted to find every hospital CEO in Minnesota to sell my services to, I could do that. Like instantaneously build a list of CEOs at hospitals in Minnesota. And these are the exact direct decision makers. Think about the power of this from a sales and prospecting perspective. No gatekeepers, no cold calls, no, you know, getting the runaround and trying to find someone's email. You can go direct to their personal LinkedIn profile, invite them to connect, engage them and talk to them. This is why it works so well. This is why there's such speed with LinkedIn and understanding when you use these filters properly, you can instantaneously jump in and create your exact ideal prospect lists. There is nothing better. Okay. There's nothing better. This, and I'm showing all the different search filters on LinkedIn. When you get Sales Navigator, you get even more. So when you pay for premium LinkedIn plans like Sales Navigator, you get even more filters. So you can say, I want people that own a company that has this many employees, that's been in business for this long, that does this much in revenue, that you know has this and this and this. And you can create these perfect ideal lists so that you're only spending time talking to your exact decision makers. That's why prospecting on LinkedIn is as good as it gets. Again, to really summarize this for you, LinkedIn is like Google search for B2B leads, okay? You can use different search filters and Boolean search strings to find people by job title, you know, um, company type, where they went to school, all these different filters. And then you can make these lists of your exact prospects to talk to. There is nothing better than doing that. And that's the fastest way to really win business on LinkedIn. So now let's talk about 
the non sleazy way to generate leads and actually sell because that's the big thing that people struggle with is okay, I found the leads, et cetera, or you know, maybe I can make my profile look better, client facing, but how do I actually talk to people? How do I actually sell on LinkedIn? This is where you're really going to find the value and the insight. Now, first things first, I got to tell you this loud and clear. I'll scream it if I need to. On LinkedIn, all the money, all the money is in the mailbox. All of it. Okay. Let me be as clear as I can with this next slide. All the money on LinkedIn is in one-on-one -on -one messaging. The money is in the mailbox. I want you sitting at home, isolated, laughing at me right now to say this out loud with me on the count of three. We're going to say the money is in the mailbox. On the count of three. One, two, three. The money is in the mailbox. That's where it is. That's where all the money is. It's not in status updates. It's not in publishing articles. It's not in videos. It's not in all the other crazy features that you can use on LinkedIn. If you want to use LinkedIn to make money, all of it's in one-on-one -on -one messaging. Okay. And I'm going to show you that. The other great thing, because so many other people will tell you, wow, you know, I got this many views on my LinkedIn article and I got this many likes on my video and boy, I'm really getting traction and engagement and shares and all these metrics. Last I checked, and I could be wrong, feel free to correct me in the comments, but you can't deposit likes or views or shares in your bank account, can you? Right? Like, I want money. I want to make sales. I got to feed these kids. None of those metrics matter to me. I want to talk to people one-on-one -on -one and sell them. That's the goal with the money in the mailbox. So here's an example of how I use LinkedIn every single day to fill up my webinars, to get Folks just like you um, opting in, wanting to learn to come onto a training, right? So we, I did this manually just as a test of how fast I could do it. In two minutes, I had five people sign up for my webinar. You can see the screenshot where I used one of the scripts that I'll be showing you. I messaged people on LinkedIn one-on-one, -on -one, invited them to a webinar. In two minutes, five people wrote back and said, yes, I want to get in. That's how to do this. Like I didn't spend a ton of money on Facebook ads. I didn't have to spend money on you know, uh, paid traffic and all that, like just go on LinkedIn and talk to people. Like this is where it's at. Now the key to this is really understanding LinkedIn, the secret sauce to the money being in the mailbox is one-on-one -on -one personal engagement, okay? It's personalized engagement, not just hammering people with sales pitches and spam. Instead, treating it like a one-on-one -on -one coffee meeting. And I'm gonna show you some examples. One of my favorite current methods that I have been telling a lot of my LinkedIn Riches students about and clients is using the LinkedIn mobile app. Because what you can do with the LinkedIn mobile app is you can actually send personalized video messages. You can send personalized audio messages. Right inside the LinkedIn mobile app, when you open up the messaging, you can actually just tap the video button and record and send a selfie video one-on-one -on -one to another person inside LinkedIn, just like you would with texting. Or you can actually click the little audio icon there, send people a little voice memo. And think about sales and engagement and people getting to know, like, and trust you. How much more powerful is it instead of just sending people written text to actually send them audio so they can hear your voice, they can hear your emotion, they can hear your passion, or even better, sending them a video where they can see you, they can look you in the eye, they can have that cave person brain of theirs respond and react to you at that you know psychological level of, oh, this is a real person. This isn't a robot. It's actually John sending me a video. And I do this all the time with prospects. Uh, here's an example of how I closed a five-figure client last year doing this where, hey, I wanted to circle back on yesterday's conversation, super excited to get you going, blah, blah, blah. And then I just went out on my front porch and shot a quick video. And you can see in the LinkedIn feed, it shows up right there um, as your ability to send a, um, a video. And somebody asked, I think it was Suzanne, asked, can you do that from desktop? No, you have to use Right now, you can't send LinkedIn videos from your desktop. You have to do it through your mobile app. So I just pull out my phone. I open up the message with the person, and I just shoot them a quick video or audio. Yes. Uh, Stuart, yes, you can send saved videos from your phone, I believe, as well. Uh, I'd have to test that, but I'm pretty sure you can. So again, here's an example of audio messages. A client of mine, Bob Cantor, did this where you know he just dropped in an audio. And you can see it shows up where you can tap play, and the prospect can listen to your audio message right inside of that. Like, think about this. Think about the power of your personality coming through a one-on-one -on -one LinkedIn message. This is where it's at, right? Prospecting gold is understanding how much you can now personalize LinkedIn engagement 
with one-on-one video messages, with one-on-one audio messages, just like you would do in real life at a coffee shop. So before I finish up, though, I want to talk a little bit about the secret sauce behind this. You've got to really overlay the real life you into your one-on-one messages. Just like in real life, you introduce yourself, you let your personality out, you communicate, you have a certain sense of humor and style. Bring that into your online engagement. Overlay the real life you into your online presence, okay? Here's an example with Paul Klein, a good buddy of mine, a client of mine. This is Paul, and he look, he's a super smart guy. He's a seven-figure consultant. He's got this amazing program called Rock Your Pricing. You'll be hearing more about it. Um, but, you know, this was his normal branding, and this is Paul right today. And when I started to talk to Paul and get more of his life story, he's like, oh, yeah, back in the 80s, I was in a hair metal band. Like, how awesome is this? In fact, unsolicited comment request, put it in the comments right now, your favorite 1980s hair metal band. Favorite, I'm going to type this in, 1980s hair metal band. Go. Favorite 80s hair metal group. For me, without a doubt, number one with a bullet was Guns N' Roses, man. Axl Rose all the way. Whoa, 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 sweet child. I'll stop. (laughs) Brenda's going with Poison. All right, Vince Neil approves. I mean, hair metal was the best, right? Especially if you're on the ace. Rat! Come on, Drew! Come on, man! Oh, my God. Pink Floyd is not a hair metal band. Stuart, you can't do this! Maria Van Halen with David Lee Roth. Outstanding. Deep Purple. That's like 70s, though. Kiss! All right, Paul Klein would love you. He loves Kiss. Metallica back in the day. Poison. All right, all right. Alice. Alice Cooper, right? Not Alice in Chains. But Paul, so this is the point, right? The Doobie Brothers, Guns N' Roses, the best. Oh my gosh, they were just unbelievable. So I told Paul when we were working together, I'm like, let's take your hair metal days, right? You're this successful consultant that teaches people how to price their services and get paid what they're worth. Let's create a brand and a persona, rock your pricing, Like, how much more fun is that instead of just learning from Paul? It's uh, rock your pricing, right? And so now we've rolled in the real life. That's just part of his story. It's fun. It's a hook. It's a narrative. But bring that banter in. Now, this part, uh, not Sammy and Van Halen. Van Halen was way better with David Lee Roth, Maria. I'm going to stop you right there. Hard stop. Suzanne's going with Alice Cooper. Love it. All right. Anyone here from Wisconsin? I'm going to show you. The idea of one-on-one LinkedIn messaging. I think Zach is from Wisconsin. We've already had this banter and this good natured. When I find a prospect from Wisconsin, I have all sorts of fun in the one-on-one messages, right? Because I live in Minnesota and our quote-unquote neighbors to the east are our arch rivals. Minnesota and Wisconsin, with our sports teams, we're like the Hatfields and McCoys. Uh, If you live in the southern United States, we would be like Alabama and Auburn, right? SEC rivals. Those two schools and their fan bases hate each other, right? It's either War Eagle or Roll Tide. There's no in-between. So in Minnesota, it's either the Gophers or the Badgers or the Vikings or the Packers. So here's what I do to break the ice. When I see a prospect who lives in Wisconsin, one of the things you can do with LinkedIn and their one-on-one messaging is insert video and audio, but also animated GIFs and emojis. So I start talking trash about Wisconsin, again, just to break the ice, just to get some conversation going, just like I would in real life. And this is an example of a one-on, oh, don't even remind me, Zach, who has Paul Bunyan's ex. We were robbed. We were robbed. We'll be back. I'm going to roll the boat. Sky you, ma. I'm all in on PJ Fleck. All right. So anyway, have fun. Oh, the Iowa Hawkeyes. You know what the best thing to come out of Iowa is, Bob Kenny? The best thing to come out of Iowa? I-35, baby. Oh, you're finished. Go ahead. Mic drop. I, I could do Iowa jokes all day. Don't get me started, Bob. All right. So anyway, this is the point of all this. And I know we're having fun. When you're engaging prospects on LinkedIn, one on one messaging, the big advantage you have is you. It's your unique personality. It's your unique story. It's your unique communication style. It's your storytelling. Like Paul Klein with the hair metal days. Bring that out. Like people want to connect. People want to connect. And this is the big thing. This is how we are in real life. Do the same thing with your one-on-one LinkedIn engagements that you do in real life. Talk to people like you talk to them in real life. Break the ice. Don't start with a sales message. Don't start with asking for 15 minutes of their time. Be yourself on LinkedIn, be yourself. And here's why I love this. And I started today 
uh, this presentation wearing Zubas and being a goofball because you know what happens when I am just my authentic, genuine, goofy self? I attract people who enjoy that. I attract people who are like, you're going to be fun to work with. You're not the everyday LinkedIn trainer. You're a goofball, 80s jokes, et cetera. I want to work with someone who's going to make me laugh while I work LinkedIn. And I repel people that, oh, I have to be serious and wear a suit and tie and you're not serious enough for me. That's fine. Like, I, I don't want those types of clients. And the same for you. And I'm not saying you have to copy anyone else. Just be yourself. Bring through your unique personality. Share your real self, communication style, jokes, passions. You'll attract people who enjoy that and who bond with you around that. And best of all, you repel the nightmare clients because you're being genuine and authentic and you wouldn't want to work with them anyway. It would be terrible. Remember, there's 700 million people on LinkedIn. Like You don't have to win them all as clients, okay? And again, this is really something we're seeing more than ever while we're all trapped at home. So many people will pose online and just pretend everything's perfect, hashtag blessed, you know, greatest life ever. We got to get away from that. People are craving authenticity, transparency, and human connection. That's really what they want when they're engaging with you online, okay? So how do we now pivot this to actually selling, right? How do we actually pivot this to selling? Because that's the secret thing. You cannot immediately start trying to ask for a sale. The amount, whatever you're asking someone to do, if you're asking for a phone call, asking them to go to your webinar, asking them to read your blog, it has to be in direct proportion to the amount of trust you've earned so far. You cannot skip that step, right? You've got to build rapport. You've got to build some trust. Then you can pivot. And I've got a great script that I like to use for this. But just before I get to that, remember, don't try to marry people on your first LinkedIn date, okay? <laughs> Break the ice. Practice professional courtship. Use some icebreakers. Personalize your engagement. Look at the other person's profile. See where they went to school. See where they live. Comment about the weather. There's all kinds of ways you can do that. Here's all these different icebreaker ideas you can use, right? Where they live, where they went to school, hobbies, volunteering. All of that's right there for you to use. The key is... Creating context for a conversation. You need to create context for a conversation. That's the secret sauce with this. I've got a great story. I don't have time to do it all right now called Send It In Jerome, where I found a prospect on LinkedIn. And the only thing I found out about him was he went to the University of Pittsburgh in the 1980s. All I knew about the University of Pittsburgh in the 80s when I was looking at this prospect's profile was Send It In Jerome, like this great basketball play. You can see a photo of it where Jerome Lane went up, dunked the basketball, and literally during a nationally televised college basketball game, shattered the glass backward. The rim came down, and Bill Rafferty, the famous announcer, you can YouTube this. YouTube send it in, Jerome. You'll see the clip. He yells out, send it in, Jerome. Send it in. So when I was messaging this prospect on LinkedIn, I started with, hey, I see you went to Pitt during the 1980s. Do you remember send it in, Jerome? He wrote back right away with his 60 seconds, I was at the game. Like, so all of a sudden he's reminiscing with me about being a student at Pitt, remembering the game. Now he's curious. Now that the ice is broken, he looked at my profile. This prospect was a debt collector. So guess what? My profile at the time said debt collection marketing services. I help debt collectors get all these benefits. He writes me back right away after looking at my profile and says, hey, your timing's really interesting. I looked at your profile. We're looking for debt collection marketing services. Can we have a phone call tomorrow to talk about it? He had a phone call the next day. He got a $10,000 contract on the spot. Like, again, it was all because I started by personalizing the conversation. He stopped long enough to engage with me because of Send It In Jerome, and we bantered and had fun, broke the ice, built rapport. Then he looked at my profile, which was all about him and client-facing. Then he looked at my other materials that I'll talk about later that were all about how I help debt collectors. Then we had the call, and it was an easy close. So that's how powerful this can be, Okay. The key to this, the script that I love to teach is called messaging magic. So let me show you this. There's a couple key parts to it. One is you ask a question, and I'll break this down for you in a second. This is the ultimate one-on-one -on -one LinkedIn message, by the way, right? Ask a question, offer something of value, you ask permission, you give a simple call to action, and then you remove the pressure. So let me show you what this looks like in an actual script. Here's an example of this, what I call the ultimate one-on-one -on -one LinkedIn message. This is my favorite sales template to use on LinkedIn. So, hey, insert the name of the person. Hope this finds you well. Curious, are you interested in blank? And blank is something, a topic, a benefit they would want. So for me, it might be curious, are you interested in getting more clients with LinkedIn? 
or curious? Are you looking for insights in how to win new business online? Whatever it is, right? And then you pivot the next sentence. If so, I have a great blank, something free that demonstrates your value. I have a great free resource, webinar, podcast episode, video, or right now I'm offering a free audit of you know websites for people that are interested. Whatever it is, something to demonstrate your expertise. Then you ask permission. If you'd like to see it, just reply with the word yes or thumbs up, whatever, and I can send you over a link. And then you take the pressure off. And if you're not interested, no worries at all. That's so right? Uh, and if someone, if Betty got cut off, oh, Betty, uh, refresh. Let's try and refresh. Hopefully everybody else can still hear me because we're getting to the good stuff. Okay. So that's the ultimate one-on-one script here. This is an example of how I do this right now with building my email list. Hey, you know, insert name, hope you're well. Curious, are you interested in using LinkedIn to find clients and customers? If so, I've got a great and free on-demand webinar, right? Just reply with the word yes or thumbs up. I can send you a link. And you can see at the bottom, Andre, thumbs up. I put him on the webinar. This is how fast and easy this is. Now, this routes him into an on-demand webinar. He opts in. He starts getting emails. This is content marketing at its finest. But this is how fast and simple this template works on LinkedIn after you've broken the ice and warm people up. Now, important tip I want to share is your content, whatever you're giving people, is the currency that you're going to use to buy their time and attention. You can't just claim authority. You've got to really demonstrate it to people. You've got to really show people how you can help them get quick wins. Just like on this webinar, I'm trying to demonstrate authority. I'm not just telling you I'm awesome at LinkedIn. I'm giving you quick win tips. Here's how to fix your headline. Here's the first sentence. Here's a message template, right? I'm trying to demonstrate some expertise for you to buy your time and attention on this webinar. So this is the real kind of core list for prospecting and engaging on LinkedIn. Personalized one-on-one engagement. You can do the video and audio through the LinkedIn app. Use those icebreakers, practice professional courtship, ask permission, use that one-on-one script that I'm talking about. Remember your content and how important that is, right? There's so many different things that go into this. Okay, all right, let's, I gotta, whoop, okay. So one other thing, that's actually, oh, there's a funny story behind that too, that text that just came in. I'll tell it later. Okay, but that's another LinkedIn prospect that's now turning into a client. I love it. Okay, so anyway, um, what to do next before we finish up today, update your profile, right? Use that template, that approach I gave you, what I do, how I do it, how it works. Start prospecting and connecting, right? Send those one-on-one messages. All the money is in the mailbox. Now, now I have something special today. Before we finish, uh, who remembers Choose Your Own Adventure? Type yes in the comments if you remember Choose Your Own Adventure. That was the greatest book series ever. And I want to offer something to everyone today. If you want my help, if you want me to directly help you implementing what we're sharing today, even if you already have the LinkedIn Riches online course, there are other levels of Nemo that you can get. You can get full Nemo if you want, okay? There are three ways that we can work together, okay? There are three ways I can help you. One is you can do it yourself, and I've got a great online course called LinkedIn Riches that I'm going to share with you in a second. The second one is I can do it with you. You can get the online course, and I can coach or consult with you. And then the third is what I would really call the full Nemo, which is done for you. So here's what I want to share. So I'm going to share a couple links. First off, um, let me – I'm going to get rid of this slides. And I'm going to come back on and give you the links. Okay, so can everybody see me? The Zubas are still on. Nothing has changed. Okay, Uh, here is the link to. um, Okay, this is a link to LinkedIn Riches right there. So I'm going to put that uh, online course. And I have a special for that right now. So you can sign up. Um, Brenda says, hot mama. Hey! It's getting better. Okay, Suzanne says LinkedIn Riches. Suzanne has a great story. Uh, Suzanne and I met at Social Media Marketing World. And I'll actually share my screen so you can see the course that I'm talking about before I get to the full Nemo options. Okay, you should see my screen. Earning money from it before you even finished. Yeah, Suzanne said that. I'm going to make that public so people can see. Um, Broadcast comment, baby. Okay, so if you can't see this, yeah, Suzanne is telling you how good this is. And so... The link I just put up is for LinkedIn Riches. This is the online course and everything you get in it. It's got, let me go down to the quick summary. 
Da, 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 da. It's okay. So here's what you actually are getting with LinkedIn Rich is the online course. This is do it yourself. You're getting video training. You're getting copy and paste scripts and templates. There's a risk-free 30-day money-back guarantee. It's all on demand. It's all online. Um, so you can go through it at whatever pace you want. It's divided into three sections. And all the information is on this page. In fact, I will use my little webinar jam ninja moves here. And I will open up this page for everyone. So everyone should have that opening up in a tab. Okay. All right. Good. Um, serious inception going on there. <laughs> yeah. So, so this is the online course. And I have a special right now. You can sign up. There's two options. One is you can do $197 a month payment plan. So it's 12 times 200. Basically, you, you can sign up this way and you get the entire online course immediately or you can do a one-time payment of $2,000. Either way, you just click Get Started, and it's going to bring you through to the checkout page. And this is what's really funny about this is, and then you see here on the checkout page, you're going to get two options. You can do a one-time payment, say 400 bucks, or do the 12 pay, right, times 200. I'm also going to give you 90 days of free group coaching. So that I have a group coaching program called LinkedIn Riches Insiders. You're going to get 90 days of that free uh, right away that's i do live coaching calls every month we have a private facebook group community all of that's included it doesn't matter which payment plan you take today uh, you'll get immediate access to the whole course okay other great thing that i want to share is i'm going to throw in something special for anyone who signs up today i'm going to give you a one-on-one -on -one call i'm going to give you 60 minutes of john nemo like 60 minutes one-on-one, -on -one, you and me on a Zoom call consulting, okay? And again, no matter what you sign up for with the online course, if you do the 197 a month, if you do the full plan, um, you will get, if you sign up today, right now, you get the online course, all of that, plus an hour of my time, plus 90 days of group coaching. So you're getting as everything in the kitchen sink, which is fantastic, right? And this is honestly the fastest, easiest way for you to get clients, get business on LinkedIn. If you're liking what you're seeing today, this takes it to an even newer level and it's just as fast. Like it's really understanding how quickly you can implement this and apply it, okay? And so that, let me open up my little live chat, make sure that's working. Um, hopefully people are getting, is the link working for people? I wanna make sure, okay, let's see. Oh yeah, people are on there, okay, good. All right, good. And there's a little live chat box, but I'm live right now. But anyway, um, let me show you the other thing. So you've got the webinar offer um, right now here. You can sign up. You get an hour of coaching. You get 90 days of free group coaching. All of it comes with a risk-free 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's literally no risk for you. You sign up today. Um, you can go through the training in less than 10 hours. You can start implementing it immediately. And one of the things, Suzanne is actually on the call right now. She talked about, um, where is Suzanne? Like, you were earning money from it before you even finished. Like, Suzanne is, yeah, I mean, she, we met at Social Media Marketing World. And I remember offering you the course, Suzanne. And you're like, ah, okay, is there a guarantee? I'm like, yeah, you got a 30-day guarantee. There's no risk. You know what I mean? Like, I'm going to put skin in the game. I'll give you coaching and everything. You got clients from this before you even finished section one. Like you had those 90 leads and now you're like, you're not even, you still haven't finished the course. Like you're killing it. So the people that are killing it with the online course, again, um, it, that's the secret sauce. Now I want to tell you one other thing. If you want to work with, uh, if you want me to do this directly for you or with you, I have another package. It's called, there's basically two of them, but one is I would do it with you. And one is I would do the whole thing for you. Okay, so let's do this. Let me put this in the comments. I'm gonna stop the screen share for one second. Uh, if you want my help, if you want John Nemo help, go here. Um, this would be the done for you or done with you. And I'll need you to fill out an application. And I'll show you that in a second. Um, and for those that have already joined the course, yes. I mean, obviously, uh, Leonard, I'll look at your profile and give you feedback and everything. You know that. Um, uh, so, but if you want to take it to the next level, like if you've already signed up for the course and you want more help, uh, or if you want to just bypass the online course and go right to full Nemo, what I want you to do is use that link I just put up and let me uh, remove that. I'm going to put it into the chat box here. Full Nemo option. 
That will lead you to an application page because I, I, I want to make sure and vet people <laughs> and make sure I can help you. Uh, I'm not just going to take money and you know what I mean? Like the, the done with you and the done for you is obviously a huge commitment for me. So I want to make sure you're a good fit. And there is a ability um, for me to, to do that, to talk with you right away. So here's what I want to do. Uh, I'll actually put in a screen share. Okay, so I'm going to also open up the application page for people. And let me show you real quick. I've got a live chat cooking here, so hold on one second. Um, this is what the application page looks like. So you've got two options to, to start with me today. One is grab the online course. You're going to get the do-it-yourself online course. You're going to get an hour of my one-on-one -on -one help regardless. It has a 30-day risk-free guarantee. Um, the other option, if you want me to do it with you and give you extra consulting, uh, or if you want me to do a whole program for you, I have complete done-for-you services where I literally, I rewrite your profile. I rewrite and do all your messaging. I do all your scripts. I do all your searches. I get you all the leads, and I just bring them to you. That's another option too. So if you're interested in those options where I do it all for you uh, or do it with you at a higher level, you know, the course plus help, just go to this page, linkedinriches.com slash application. There's a big button here that says apply now. It'll open up this type form application. You just fill out some questions real quick. You'll go through it. You'll see, tell me a little bit more about yourself. And then what I will be able to do on the back end is follow up with you and say, okay, Based on what you're telling me, here's what I think is a good fit. Here's what, you know, I don't think I can help you, whatever it might be. So it's totally up to you. Um, what a lot of people do is they immediately grab the course and then they decide, hey, you know what? I want extra help. I'm going to do the done with you too. You know, and so you can do both, like just get the course and then we can talk more too about adding on some extra coaching for you personally. But the way that I've set up today's offer is you're going to get uh, coaching included. So you're going to get a one-on-one -on -one call with me in 90 days of group coaching. And then the work with me, if you know, if you're just like, Hey, look, one new client for me is worth 25 grand, 15 grand, 10 grand, like just go get me business quickly. Then that's, you know, apply now. And I mean, so that it just depends on you and your business model and what one new client is worth. And it also just depends on how much work you want to do yourself versus how much you want me to do for you or with you. So with all that said, I'm going to leave these pages open, leave these options open. And I want to make sure people get signed up. Um, so let me turn off the screen share and I'm going to start looking at comments. Um, Leo, I'm not sure what's going on with yours. I received a webinar alert to move the... Oh, yeah. I just opened up some new tabs um, so that you can look at those pages. So let me show you, Leo, what I'm talking about. Good question. So the Webinar Jam software, sorry about the inception mode there, Zach, but you can open up uh, new tabs for people. So I, there should be two tabs open. One is the LinkedIn Riches forward slash special hyphen 222. This is the online course. Just click the green button to get started and sign up. And again, anyone that signs up right now, yes. I'm going to give you the one-on-one -on -one bonus call and group coaching. And then the other option is if you want to do it with me or you want me to do the whole thing for you, then fill out this application. Just click apply now. Take you a minute, fill out the application. I will then get it on my end and I'll give you a phone call or whatever and we'll talk through it. Um, but that's, that's the two options. And I want to make sure now that I get into the questions. Okay, so let's go through this way. I hear new visit. I love the sound of the English lady's voice. That's the best. All right, let me turn off screen share for a second. Um, I had a chat, so I want to make sure, um, someone's saying I have to think about my market. I'm a speaker performance strength coach. I don't know where my market is shopping and hanging out. Maybe speaking is LinkedIn, but training could be Facebook. I'm going to say yes, for sure. Let's do it. So yeah, if you're not sure, that's the beautiful thing about the course is, and I'm talking to whoever I'm live chatting with, somebody in Denver, Colorado. I can see that on my little live chat software. But if you're not sure, that's the beauty of the online course and exploring. I, I will tell you this. If you're only doing business to consumer, like you're selling hairbrushes to teenage girls, then LinkedIn's not for you, right? Um, there's a system alert that is the link. Leo. Oh, uh, hopefully that makes sense. Hopefully people are seeing the links. Um, if not, I'll put them back in. Okay. So let me put these links in the chat one more time, just to make sure link to online course. 
check the chat box. Here's the link to the online course. That's the special two, two, two. And then I'll say, um, Income and chat. link to work with John on for you. I'll put in the done for you one there. Okay. So then, um, but yeah, for people that aren't sure, like there's 700 million members on LinkedIn. So chances are very, very good. Um, oh, somebody says they're signing up. I know from reading book that you're a guitar geek too. Favorite, ooh, I am a guitar geek. All right, all right. So somebody, whoever you're signing up, I love it. I can't wait to work with you. Let me get my, where's my ax? Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is live. Anything is possible. You want it the best? You got the best, baby. Oh, here, get this. Somebody wanted to see my guitar. Here it is. Oh, it's a cherry red Fender Strat Texas Lone Star. Oh, out of tune. <laughs> I got to tune this baby up, but um, we're going to rock. Here's the deal. I want you to get signed up today. So either get the online course and it comes with an hour of coaching and 90 days of free group coaching, which I'm putting in right now today. You can sign up at either um, the one-time payment of 1997 or to a monthly payment plan. $197 a month. Um, and then you still get everything. All right. Because here's what I want to do. I want to make sure that if you have questions, eh, is my market on there? Will this work? Will it not work? We have that 30 day risk-free period for you to dive in. You can get the whole through the whole training in, in a day. Like you could spend tomorrow killing it. Like look at Suzanne and Brad, Suzanne and Brad have this incredible business in Florida, mobile notary. They hyper niched into Arizona Phoenix based attorneys where they would provide kind of on demand mobile notary services going to clients houses. Right. And you guys are past the 30 day period, but right when you got started, um, Oh, I got to call this guy back. Sorry. <laughs> um, right. When you guys got started, uh, you were getting leads like before section one was even done. You guys were rocking it. So like, that's the thing about it. Lenny says great guitar. Oh, Love this thing, Lenny. Did you guys know I used to play in a band? I was I was the biggest thing you never heard of, man. We were huge. We played the Caboose on a Saturday night. We played O'Gara's. The biggest crowd we ever played for was a 1,000 people on a Saturday night on Valentine's Day. I'll never forget that. Uh, I can find band photos. I didn't do hair metal, but uh, we played. We were like Hootie and the Blowfish. We were kind of pop rock. Not very exciting. <laughs> but anyway, I want everyone to get signed up. Um, if you have any questions, put them into the chat. I want to read through here and make sure I'm not missing anything. Um, okay. Yeah, and if people have already signed up for the course before and you want to go deeper, fill out that application page, and we can talk about um, helping you with more consulting and coaching beyond what we're doing. All right. Debbie says, great information. Sign up for your course. Great to have a refresher. Um, Philip says, should we subscribe to Navigator? Yes, you should. Yeah, for all the reasons I outlined, you'll get a ton more quality leads um let's see uh okay brenda says i have to go back to work to make money for someone else you're awesome <laughs> i love it okay uh yeah okay um yeah see and suzanne points out a good thing about the training she said she stopped the videos as she was going through the training implemented what she was learning because you can just pause the video use the template next to it implement what you're learning and she was already getting leads so that's the power of this course. And again, I took all the fat out. If you notice today's presentation, I didn't talk about publishing content on LinkedIn and status updates and videos because none of that matters if you want to make money. The one-on-one -on -one messaging is all that matters. So the great news for you is that you can go through this very quickly and effectively and immediately get business. So if that's something you want to do, then I want you to sign up for the course or I want you to, you know, fill out the application if you're like, just do it all for me, dude. Like, so um, let me do this. I got to write someone back. Um, get the ban on YouTube, Lenny. I know, right? Okay. Just going to, um, let me handle, I got a couple questions in live chats coming in here. Um, sorry on a live webinar. We'll call you shortly. All right. Someone's trying to pay me money for a done for you. And I have to come back. Um, I love it. Ah! Okay. Who's signing up? Tell me. Yes. Oh, Garris is leaving Maria. I can't believe it. I know. All right. Susanna saying great results. I got live chats coming in. 
All right, Rich, welcome to the jungle. Rich, I love it. Get in there, baby. All right, somebody says um, they're already, oh, wow, somebody's working hard. I love it. Um, okay, uh, finish the profile. Okay, network marketing. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, love it. All right, Max says yes. All right, who's signing up? Max, are you getting in? Get in here, baby. I love it. All right. Leonard says, does LinkedIn punish you for rejected connection requests? Um, not unless you get a ton of them and not unless people mark it as I don't know, Leonard. Like, so you'd be fine. Like you, and I show you in the training how to withdraw and how to make sure that you don't get killed on that. I mean, that's obviously important. So, um, let me, let me know if you're getting signed up. I want to take good care of you, uh, and make sure we get you locked in. Um, all right. Um, oh, somebody's asking what the cost is of a full done for you. Pat, yeah, email me, Pat, and I can kind of talk through it with you. You may have a referral, it sounds like. The Done For You programs and the Done With You programs, I really need the person to go through the application just so I know how much you need of my help. Uh, If you're not sure, if you're like, well, I want to work with you, John, I'm just not sure, just sign up for the course, and we can always transition you into a Done For You or Done With You. So I just want to make sure we get you in and get you going, right? And I think, too, um, I wanted to put out the, the option to, you know, fill out the application. If you just know, if you're some people, the gentleman that signed up yesterday was like, look, I know what you're doing. I read your book. I love your stuff. I would rather just pay you to do it for me. You're the expert. I don't want to have to learn how to do all this. I'm going to run my business. You just bring me the leads. I'll close them. So that's, that's the done for you is I just bring you the leads and you close them. And it's obviously there's, just, we take a deep dive in your business and all that. And we don't work with a ton of people at once, but that is an option for people that want to do that. Um, and a ton of people like Suzanne, which I'm so glad you're on it, like get the online course and kill it. Or like Vivica, uh, I don't know if she's still on, but like she got, she's getting five figure clients. So it's like, I mean, you could take that online course. You can start it tomorrow and be getting business. Like it's meant for quick wins. So honestly, I just want to challenge anyone that's on the fence about it to say, what are you waiting for? Like there's no risk involved to do this. There's a 30 day risk free refund period. And honestly, whether we like it or not, this is a new normal. (laughs) So the good news for you is I've already figured this out. Like I've refined this since 2012 to to a point where now it's very easy to sell your services online using LinkedIn. And I'll give you the exact words. I'll give you the exact phrases. I'll coach you up. Even if you sign up for the online course, you get an hour with me to coach you up. Uh, You get 90 days of group coaching, a private Facebook group where people will be there to support you. It really is uh, the simplest, easiest way right now, especially to get business. And even if you don't necessarily directly sell on LinkedIn, maybe it's building referral partners. Maybe it's building, I work with a lot of realtors and it's like, well, can I sell a house on LinkedIn? I'm like, no, but you can connect with people in certain communities that will send you business. And that's a lot cheaper than, you know, wrapping a bus or a bench you know um is building relationships so um go pack go get out of here zach leave 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 all right uh maria says several people wanted to connect with me but i don't know why no personal note right some advisors say connect with everyone i'm not confident i should what are your thoughts um andrea i'll address that that's a good question maria and then andrea has a question too um oh yeah okay andrea let me answer yours first andrea are you still here Type yes if you are, Andrew, because I have an idea for you. Andrew says, okay, I'm going to share my screen so people can see what I'm reading. And tell me in the comments if you're signing up. I want to celebrate with you. So say I'm, I'm in if you're, if you're signing up. Go Hawks, Chad Greenway. Okay, I love it. All right, so Andrew says, can you help me? I'm a coach working with women over 40 who are struggling going through big changes. I can't think how to niche down. So let me show you an example of that, Andrea. That's a good question. I'm going to... Put that up here on LinkedIn. Uh, I'm thinking of Mary Olk, one of our done for you clients. We niche her down into um, female executives, right? So same kind of thing. Like Mary has a great background. She's worked with a ton of big name clients. So we put that in her header. But then we really talked about executive coaching for women, leadership, professional development, and really talked about, you know, what I do. I've helped women for the past 25 years do these things, where you've seen my work, what makes her unique, right? And what she's talking about. And then obviously some testimonials. So you could niche in a similar way 
um, and just talk about some of the types of professional women you've worked with and then pivot to them. So, so Andrea, like, yeah, just what types of professional women have you worked with? Have you worked with uh, women that own small businesses? Have you worked with women in healthcare? Have you worked with women in whatever industry or niche? Niche into that on LinkedIn. I help um, women own or small business. Uh, I help women who own small businesses. I help female healthcare executives. I help um, whatever type of industry. Just take two or three of your clients that you've had the most success and breakthrough with, niche to them on LinkedIn. And then create content about that, create a case study to really make that sing. I mean, that's kind of the secret sauce behind this. All right. So, Andrea, so, yeah, like, here's an example. I'll give you an example of how we did this with Melissa Thibodeau. And I always am citing her, I feel like, because she's doing such a great job. Whoops. Where'd she go? Okay. So, here's an example where Melissa came to me. Um, she was leaving her day job and starting out as a consultant, right? And so, she had worked in the staffing industry, had a ton of success, won a bunch of big clients and contracts in the staffing industry. So we pivoted and made her a consultant, right? So growth strategist for the staffing industry, sales and recruiting process creation and optimization, what I do, right? I help this audience, staffing organizations, get these benefits, you know, by providing this, right? Coaching, training, consulting. So what we did though, to take it to another step is we created um, content for her. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So we actually created a blog post. This is a done for you service, but you can do the same thing. And I teach you how to do it in the online course. Um, basically, we did a case study. We took one of her most successful stories where she was working at a staffing agency and helped engineer this insane turnaround, right? From 600 grand a year in revenue to 16 million. Like what? And then, you know, told it as a good story, demonstrate expertise. Here's the steps I used, right? Which was huge. Um, and then, you know, was able to say, you know, here's what I did and then had a call to action. If you're looking for help here at the bottom, you know, uh, let's talk. I can help you out. Right. So what she was able to do within the first week of kind of getting LinkedIn Riches going and publishing this content, she had someone call her. I think he was in Orlando and he's like, hey, what's it going to cost to fly you to my down to Orlando for two days to train my whole team? You know, so that I think that ended up being like a five figure client for her. So this is how fast it can be. And it really is that powerful. And I want you to know that. I think that's important to know um, what you can do. Oh, good. I see new users coming in. I love it. I love it. I love it. So let me know if you're getting started up. Um, if you have any other questions, uh, Leonard, you've got some good questions. Uh, we can hit these. We're having a group coaching call. So anyone that signs up actually next week, I'm having a private members coaching call. So that'll be good for people that are just signing up today. What about connect requests from people who have no obvious connection, especially those out of the country Hmm. I'm going to get into that with you on the call, Leonard. I have some thoughts. Um, let me do this. Before we finish, I want to make sure you see these pages and get signed up right now. So for anyone that wants to do the online course, you get this special 197 bucks a month times 12 months payment plan. You get a one-on-one -on -one coaching call. You get group coaching for free 90 days. I'm going to pop that in one more time. Make sure everybody sees it. So I'll turn off the screen share. Bring out the Zubas. All right. There's that tab is open. Um, so pop in there and then also we can live chat in there one-on-one. -on -one. So for anyone that wants to continue the conversation, let's do this. I'm going to end the live signal for now because I know we've gone over. Hop over to that page, that linkedinriches.com. Oh, I hear the British ladies telling me you guys are coming back. I love it. Okay. So let's do remove, put that in. Um, Talk with me one-on-one -on -one in the live chat in there. Um, so on that LinkedIn Riches uh, course page, there should be a live chat in the bottom corner. I'll hop over there, and then I can live chat with you, answer more questions, make sure this is a good fit for you, et cetera, et cetera, and go from there. Because I want to make sure that we get you in and we get you all the best options so that this weekend you can start getting leads. Like what else are your prospects doing right now? They're sitting home, looking around online, bored, watching Netflix. Like what an opportunity for you to go on the offensive, to take action, to start engaging them on LinkedIn the right way and really get results. Like, I think that's the big thing. I don't, for most of you watching, I, I don't know that there's any reason why we wouldn't want you to sign up. I mean, and Andrea saying, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Andrea, I got a million ideas for you. Get signed up already. If you're not like, I, I got you, like, we're going to niche you down. It's going to be awesome. So, all right. I see people coming in the chat. I love it. I love it. I love it. 
Um, all right, so people are saying, okay. Um, when is the LinkedIn Facebook call? Somebody's asking, uh, April 23. So what's the date today? I'm looking at my watch. It's um, next Thursday, next Thursday. So yeah, when you sign up today, you'll get put into our private Facebook group. That's where you get access to me every day. We do, I go live in there. I went live in there yesterday. Um, we have an amazing community of people like Vivica and Suzanne and others in there helping and giving ideas and sharing wins. And then I also um, do live training each month too with that group. So um, I will, I, uh, it's in Facebook group. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out, uh, sorry, uh, I can send to you if you email me. Okay. Um, somebody says I have my, okay. Struggle to get business partners, but no problem getting customers. Okay. So I'm going to jump over to live chat. Cause we've got so much stuff going on. Hop over to the live chat. If you're not there already. New visitor. All right. People are popping in. Go, go, go. Look at this. Look at the bright yellow. Oh my gosh. Your eyeballs should be seared now. Hop over to live chat. Let's keep going. Get signed up. Cause I want to make sure by Monday morning, you're prospecting and getting business. Doesn't that sound awesome? Doesn't that sound amazing? Like, oh my God, I could transform everything in one day and start getting leads. And I mean, if you look on the sales page too, you're going to see all these results and all these regular people getting incredible wins. So I want you doing the same thing. So get signed up. Okay. So here's what I want to do. Go over to that link from the chat, the linkedinriches.com special 222. Click on that. It'll open up a new tab. Click on live chat, and then you and I can keep talking one-on-one, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. So appreciate each and every one of you. Cannot wait to work with those of you that are signing up. Um, Let's do this. Let's get you rolling. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Get a pair of Zubas. Get a pair of Zubas. They're great pants. Trust me. All right, I'll talk to you all soon. Thanks, everybody. (laughs) 